I was asked if I would share this morning with the children a theme around Veterans Day. And being a veteran, I value that with a great deal of pride. So seeing we're all God's children, I figure to have all of you sit in front of me so we can share with you what I believe a veteran means. And for those of you who are veterans, in a moment I'm just going to ask you to stand if you would. But right now I'd like a little help. Uh, Adrian Amaya, are you willing to help? Adrian, would you come up and help? No? But Amaya will. So, I'll have Amaya hold this for you. I'm often asked about, come, come up one more step, sweetie, and one more. There you go. So, what does it mean to be a veteran? And I have lots of friends who are veterans, and sometimes we'll get into a discussion and they'll say, well, you know, I served during peacetime, I wasn't in combat, and I try to express to them that's so unimportant. That's not really what it's about. What it's about is the check that you gave. So I have a live copy of that check that every veteran signed when they enlisted. Could have been any day. It was written out to the United States of America. It's priceless. An amount up to and including their life to serve their country, and it was signed by every veteran. So Veterans Day is a day we celebrate all those men and women who served our country over hundreds of years. And for them, they signed this check. Because even in peacetime, there are all kinds of accidents that happened. And many servicemen and women died serving their country. So Veterans Day is one special day. It came out of World War I. At the end of the war, war to end all wars, if that were only true, was signed on the 11th hour of the 11th month of the 11th day. And hopefully that was the end of war, as we know that didn't happen. So originally designated as Armistice Day because it was called an Armistice <coughs> It was later changed to Veterans Day to honor all veterans. So at this point, what I would like, if there are any veterans in the audience, if you'd please stand. All right, my children, if you'll look, here are the men that we're talking, and women that we're talking about. I'm glad we have a woman here. It's so wonderful to have that. Here are the people we're sharing today, well, the 11th with. I would love for you each to give them a round of applause. Now, if, please stay standing. If I get asked my larger adult children, if you'd be willing to hand American flags. So on Monday, if you happen to go to the Peterborough Parade and you see a veteran go by, Go up and shake their hands and say, thank you for serving. And that will be your lesson for today. You are great students. No one's going to have to stay after with the teacher. <laughs> thank you all for coming up. Have a good day.